Hi, this is Brian with Boston Microscopes. Today we're featuring our refurbished Olympus BX61 upright fluorescent microscope. It's camera ready with a trinocular port, convenient and easy to use ergonomic head, six place motorized filter turret, motorized sextuple nose piece, motorized prior pro scan 2 stage with a controller, and a universal motorized eight place condenser. If you're on a limited budget, we also have additional options available. You can downgrade to a manual stage or a manual condenser. This particular system can be controlled either through Micromanager, which comes standard, or for an additional cost, VisiView software. If you want to use this manually, it's also very easy to use. There's a remote control panel over here, which can control the lights, the objectives, the filters, and the condenser. It's as easy as a push of a button. The stage can also be controlled manually or through the computer software. This microscope standard comes with a mercury illuminator but can easily be upgraded to an Excelitas or LumenCore LED light supply as well as an 89 North light supply. On this particular microscope, we have a Tuxin Diana 400 BSI SCMOS camera. Pat's going to explain that a little bit more. Hello everyone, this is Patrick from Boston Microscopes. So today we're going to be going over the Deanna 400 BSI camera from Tuscan and we're going to be using their software which is called Mosaic. Uh, I find this software to be some of the easiest using softwares that I've ever had to use. Uh, so you have just your main control panel with auto adjustment for exposure. Uh, you can click HDR high gain CMS, you can change your resolutions. Uh, and then you have your ROI section, image adjustment section, which is kind of like micromanager with the histogram slider, which is very helpful. Uh, then you have your image capture screen. Uh, you can set up your captures, how many frames per second. Um, and you can also use fluorescent mode. And in here, you can actually apply pseudo colors to your slides, because uh, mainly these CMOS cameras are monochrome. Um, so you can apply whatever color you're using for your filter. Uh, you can also control the temperature of the camera in this software as well. Um, so let's go ahead and open the slider on the camera right now. This is on our BX61 fully motorized fluorescent microscope. And we're viewing this under a 20x objective. So this is a pretty great image. <clears throat> and you can use these sliders right here, as you can see, to just you know bump up the intensity of the image to make it brighter or darker. And you can also hit like once AE and that will do like an auto exposure and this will adjust if you do auto minute max. And you know, I don't really like that. So I'll just bring this back down to make it a little bit brighter. So let's jump into a 40X objective and see how clear it is up close. Now that's a pretty great image, if I do say so myself. Um, I'm actually really impressed with this camera. Uh, the thing in the background you're hearing is it actually cooling right now, uh, which is a good sound for our cameras. Uh, but this image itself is very clear, very crisp. You can adjust it. Obviously, they're at different depth levels, but everything on this looks good. This software is probably the easiest software I've ever used, and I would highly recommend these camera lines. Um, so thank you for watching and please, if you have any questions, please reach out to sales at bostonmicroscopes.com or visit our website to inquire. Thank you.